Hey guys, it's Maria. Welcome back to my channel. I post videos every single Thursday giving you guys the best tips and tools for being more effective in your practice sessions and helping you achieve your musical goals. So if you're new, consider subscribing. Guys, we're at the sixth video in the jazz series, which makes me so happy. I love to make these videos for you guys and you guys love to watch them, which is awesome. Uh, for those of you who are new, I started this series back in August when I knew nothing about jazz. And to be honest, I still barely know anything about jazz, but I just opened up this book, The Jazz Piano Book by Mark Levine to page one and started learning. So thank you to everyone who joined me on this journey. We're not even halfway done through the series yet and I feel like we've already learned so much together. So thank you. And if you want to continue to follow along or work at your own pace, I will be linking this book in the description box. So be sure to check that out. Today, we're building on the tritone substitutions that we learned in the last video. If you haven't seen that one, it'll be linked up here. Go watch that first. But we're gonna start with a little review and then we're gonna add a little extra something to it. So let's get into the video. This is the tritone substitution. It's kind of like the 275717 progression, except the left hand plays a chromatic line in the bass. If you have no idea what I'm talking about, check out the previous videos here. If you want to take the tritone substitution to the next level, you can proceed the tritone substitution chord by its 5 minor 7 chord, creating another 2 7 5 7 relationship. So in the key of C major, you can swap out the 2 7 chord for 5 minor 7 of the tritone substitution chord, which is A flat minor 7, and here's what the rest of the progression sounds like. And to voice it, you want to invert the right hand notes from the original voicing, then swap out the 2 7 for the 5 minor 7 of the tritone substitution chord. Here's what it sounds like compared to the normal tritone substitution and the 2 7 5 7 1 7 progression. Now let's try that in all keys. in a song. So that's it for this video guys. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you found this video helpful. If you did, be sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to this channel for more music content. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.